Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of the EdTech Explorer. My name is Romeo, your Google Workspace for Education Certified Trainer from the Philippines. Ayan, and if it's your first time here uh, to our channel, welcome, welcome. Ayan, and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification button so you'll know our latest events and videos. Ayan, and of course po, meron din po kaming Facebook page call the EdTech Explorer. Ayan. So make sure to like and follow us as well ha. So you'll always be updated. Ayan. So maraming maraming salamat po in advance. Ayan. Okay. So paano ba natin magamit si Google Keep? Okay. So just like with Google Calendar, may pwede din natin siya ma-access using our uh, Gmail. Okay. Okay. So I'll just click this one here. Okay. So ito yung Google Keep. Uh, I will open it in a new tab para mas malaki ang ating uh, makita na screen. Ayan. So, ito po yung uh, Google Keep natin. No? So, please take note po, meron din pong mobile application si Google Keep. So, you can check out your Play Store or your App Store. Pwede nyo pong uh, i-search ang ating Google Keep no? and you can explore uh, with me. Ayan. So, taking down notes with Google Keep is uh, very, very easy to do. Okay. So, paano ba natin gawin? Okay. So, for example, uh, gusto natin mag-take uh, down notes dito. Okay. So, for example, grocery list. Okay. Tagay natin gro uh, grocery grocery uh, list. Okay. So, from here, pwede tayong mag-create uh, ng uh, checkbox, no? Or para mga list. Let's say, for example, uh, type natin um, uh, potato. Okay. Potato. So, ayan, meron pa nga lumalabas na uh, suggested words, no? Ayan. Pwede tayong maglagay ng uh, vinegar. Okay. Like so. Pwede tayong maglagay ng uh, ban? Uh, hot dogs. Ayan. And ban siguro. Mga ganyan. So, we can do a, a grocery list, no? Or we can uh, come up with a grocery list na ganito. And what's also nice about uh, this one is, uh, with this one, pwede pa natin siyang i-share, no? Itong, itong list na to, pwede natin siyang i-share sa colleagues or sa ating uh, loved ones, no? For example, uh, mayroon, mayroon uh, pupunta ng grocery at, kaila at kailangan nyo na to, pwede nyo itong i-share by simply clicking on this one here, add a collaborator, okay? Pag-click natin yan, you can add the email of that uh, person, Okay? And just click uh, save. And with that, this uh, grocery list no, is already available dun sa Google, uh, Google Keep account uh, nung uh, recipient na to or collab, uh, co collaborator natin. Okay? So, yeah. So, as easy as that, we can uh, share uh, the things to do or mga grocery list ba natin or anything na important list to anyone. Uh, by simply adding a collaborator in that uh, particular uh, Google Keep uh, node. Okay? So, another one, we can actually upload a photo. Like, for example, dito, upload ako ng photo. Okay? And then, for example, ito yung lalagay kong uh, image. And then, I want to take, uh, I want to extract, no? I want to extract the uh, the words from this image and use it as my notes, no? As, and use it as my note. So, I can simply click uh, the three dots here. Okay. Itong more. I'll click on that. And then, I will just click grab image text. No, I will just click this one. Grab image text. And look at this. Nandito na kaagad yung mga words na galing dito sa image. No? So, as simple as that. Kunwari, nag-take kayo ng photo. Lagay nyo dito sa Google Keep. Okay. And then, gusto nyo ma -ed uh, maging editable yung mga na nasa notes natin. Um... Put it here, just click it, just click itong grab image text and nandito na kaagad sa notes natin, no? And then all you have to do is uh, add a title, like for example, from, uh, from uh, Googly, okay, from Googly uh, Teacher Episode. Example po, ito yung title na gusto natin ilagay, okay? So from here, uh, pwede, natin itong maging, pwede natin itong gawin as a checklist, no? Uh, click again. Just uh, highlight on this one. Click the three, uh, the more uh, options, and click show but uh, check uh, show check boxes. Ito. Pag click natin yan, ayun checklist na kagad. Okay. So pwedeng pwede na siyang uh, gamitin. And uh, for example, kung gusto natin siyang ishare, pwedeng pwede. 
pwede nating i-change ang color, no? Uh, if you want it to, to be in color red, pwedeng pwede. Uh, color yellow, okay? Uh, itong color na to, or simply white, no? For me, mas gusto ko yung color white kasi mas uh, madali siyang makita, no? So, ayan. So, pwedeng pwede natin siyang uh, gawin and it's already part of our uh, checklist. Now, we can also do, okay? Pwede din tayo mag uh, mag-drawing, no? Gamit ang ating uh, ang ating Google Keep, no? So, you can choose a specific uh, pen, uh, a pen type here. For example, I will choose this one and then ito, ganito ang gagamitin ko. Okay? So, I can do something like this, no? Ayan. I can type my name. Okay? You can do uh, uh, a, a specific uh, note-taking habang meron kayong ini-interview. Okay? Pwedeng-pwede nyo yan uh, gawin dito. Okay? So, parang kumbaga parang notes natin no we can type as uh, we can put it as notes and then uh, after that balik lang tayo dito and nandito na kagad no nandito na yung mga na inscribble natin or sinulat natin na notes gamit ang Google Keep now if you want to add if you want it to be editable okay kunwari gusto niyo siyang i-type uh, somewhere else you don't have to type it on your own as simple as this you can click uh, the more option here and then click yung grab image text no grab image text so pag click natin yan and then for as long okay for as long as uh, readable no yung pagkakasulat natin dito as you can see naman the google keep can detect no uh, the words from the uh, scribble or from the image kaya tingnan niyo po dito meron siyang uh, the word notes nandito na na, na, na convert siya dito no so if you want to mas easier for you to grab the text from the image or from your scribble, you just have to make sure na medyo madali siyang basahin or maganda siyang pagkakasulat, no? So, ayan. So, as you can see, uh, here, nandito na kagad yung word na notes, no? And you don't have to type it, no? You don't have to type it uh, from scratch. Ayan. So, pwedeng pwede po natin tong gawin uh, with the use of um, uh, Google Keep, okay? Now, if for example, okay, if for example, uh, gusto natin siyang i-modify gamit ang ang Google Docs. Pwedeng pwede rin natin yung gawin dito sa uh, sa Google Keep. All you have to do is just to click this uh, more option here and we click the uh, copy to uh, Google Docs. Ayan. So pag-click po natin yan, alright, i-convert lang po yan ng Google Keep to uh, Google Docs, kinakopy po siya and meron na po siyang copy dito okay, as you can see, and then all you have to do is just to click open doc like so and ma-open na siya kaga dito sa uh, Google Docs natin, and with this one, pwede na, pwede na kayo mag-update ng uh, pwede nyo na kagad i-update yung document natin, no, and use it for other purposes, no so yan, so that's how useful Google Keep is uh, pwede tayong mag-take down notes Pwede tayong mag-take down notes Coming from an image Pwede tayong mag-scribble no? Magsusulat tayo mismo sa uh, sa Google Keep Pwede pwede natin yung gawin And uh, i-convert it to a Google Docs no? So that's how very very useful Ang ating Google Keep In terms of creating and sharing uh, Things to do Or mga uh, important notes With our colleagues and if you find this video useful, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the EdTech Explorer. Maraming salamat! Hanggang sa muli, paalam!